Hi Scorpio, welcome to your love reading Scorpio. Let's see what messages will show up for you. Scorpio, this is a collective love message for your sign, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your overall situation, Scorpio. Okay. We have safeguard, we have stability. What else we have for Scorpio, please? We have authentic. One more please for Scorpio. Thank you. Respect. Okay. At the bottom of the deck we have fear. Scorpio, you have someone here who wants to prove to you that they are great materi material for a long-term commitment. This is someone who might be holding back at the moment, but they are all about stability. They want to come forward uh, uh, in an authentic way that they have a good intentions and they truly respect you. We have a fear. This is someone who is afraid, Scorpio, that they might lose you. They want to kind of prove it to you that they care for you, that they that they respect you, that they want stability. And the fact that at the moment they might be holding back, it, it, it doesn't mean that they don't have uh, serious intentions towards you, okay? So let's see. We have Page of Pentacles. Could you please show us more about the situation? Page of Pentacles. We have a six of wands, we have a five of cups. Yes, this is someone who wants victory, okay, with regards to this connection. They're coming here with some sort of form of an offer, communication. This is someone, mm -hmm. for some of you, this is someone who is full of regret. And they are full of regret that, they, uh, that they've been holding back, okay that their insecurities here and lack of courage took over. Oh my gosh, look at that Scorpio. We have a king of pentacles here at the bottom of the deck. You might be dealing with the earth sign. So we have Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I also have Gemini energy. This is someone who regrets not taking action. Uh, with regards to this connection and now they're coming here with this page of pentacles like a, it is like a kind of a um, energy of um, uh, someone who might be quite shy you know it's like they're trying to figure out if 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 you are willing to 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 listen to them or to kind of accept this offer here this is someone who might simply just want to ask you out i'm getting this is a new individual or someone that you might have already met but this person here scorpio they want two of cups six of wands and the lovers this is someone who wants relationship with you period Yes, they want to show you that they truly respect you, that they are all about stability, creating a stable relationship. But I feel this person is afraid that they might lose this opportunity because they might have uh, holding back for way too long. Okay, this is someone who wants to appear very, very loyal and that they mean business. And they love you here, Scorpio. They want relationship with you. Gosh, two of cups and the lovers. Let's see this person's feelings for you. But they are coming with an offer. They will make a move here. Could you please show me this person's feelings towards Scorpio? We have a six of cups. Yes, this is someone who sees you as their soulmate. It's like they they have this feeling that they've known you for a long for, for all their life. We have seven of swords and we have page of swords. This is someone who is afraid of being hurt, being played. 
this person here, Scorpio, is very interested in you. I feel this this is someone who is trying to figure out what you're up to. If you have social media, they are actively following you on social media, your activity. You know, we have an eight of pentacles. It might be someone connected with your work. It doesn't have to be, but this is strong energy of, 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 of working, of workplace, you know. But overall, I'm seeing here someone, Scorpio, in their feelings who wants to make an effort, who wants to put the work uh, with regards to this connection. Yes, this is someone who also, again, yes, they have a tendency uh, to sabotage with the Seven of Swords. This is someone who has also kind of, um, yeah, who might be quite anxious, who might be assuming a lot, who might be afraid of the, of betrayal, you know, that someone might emotionally hurt them if they, if they are invested and then they will met with disappointment because most probably something like that happened uh, before in their life. And, um, and yes, this is someone who, who, who is, who is actively checking or who is gaining information, who's trying to figure out what you're up to and if they truly have a chance to, to be with you. But this person is in love with you here, Scorpio. And I feel they are actively, uh, I feel that some, someone can be quite jealous momentarily, but they are actively, um, you know, observing, observing you uh, or trying to figure out what's going on. But they have, they, they love you. Six of Cups is energy of soulmate. So they see you as the soulmate and we have the two of Cups and the lovers. My gosh. How this person sees Scorpio? We have three of swords. We have the hermit. You might be dealing with Virgo. How this person sees Scorpio? This person sees you, Scorpio, as someone who is very wise, but it feels like you gain this wisdom and it, based on experience. And uh, it feels like this person sees you as someone who've been through a lot. You've uh, you faced a huge disappointment, emotional pain, um, heartbreak, breakup with the Ten of Swords. It's like um, at some point, uh, at some point, uh, you might felt that kind of energy of surrender, of surrender, of surrenderance. You know, surrendering to the circumstances. I feel that you know, this person is aware that um, you've experienced something incredibly emotionally painful someone betrayed your trust it felt like someone inflicted pain into your heart metaphorically saying as you know someone here might also kind of stabbed you in the back also metaphorically saying of course it's a huge energy energy of emotional pain emotional hurt dissatisfaction and being through something that is very difficult to overcome but you've done it with the seven of cups this person here sees you as, as a catch. They might feel that, you know, many people are interested in you. It doesn't mean that you are interested in, in those people, but they see you as someone who has choices in love. Therefore, you might have many admirers, but, but your energy here is based on, you know, you going within, being healing and, and you know, coming from the place of wisdom and higher understanding. I feel, Scorpio, this person sees you incredibly strong, but also incredibly intelligent. You picked yourself up and, and you know, you, you've been through a lot here and this person is aware. Therefore, it might be also a case or a factor that this person feels that maybe, you know, at the moment you are not fully open for this kind of a for a new relationship because you are still kind of trying to heal work through certain things from the past that's been particularly difficult and with the seven of cups it's like they are um, they don't know what to do you know but we ask about how they see you they see you as someone who've been through a lot who picked themselves up who never gave up 
and who is very wise, very intelligent, and who possess a certain experience, life experience. So let's see, let's see. Will this person take, act, take action? Well, we know that they will take action indeed. But let's see the outcome for the immediate future. Let's see. Will this person take an action for the immediate future? Yes, they will, Mary. Come on. <laughs> what will happen? We have the world. We have a Four of Cups. What we have else? We have a Queen of Cups. We have a Nine. Okay. We have the star at the bottom of the deck. You might be dealing with Aquarius. This is someone who has to overcome their own fear. Because they truly want to come forward here. But I feel that this person is... I don't know. Maybe they are... <laughs> It's something like they being intimidated here by your strength, how beautiful you are, how self-sufficient you are. It's just this person here puts you on a pedestal. They are afraid of rejection. They're afraid of rejection. I'm getting someone who's taking a step back and then taking two step, sorry, taking step step forward and taking step two step back because um, they're seeing you in this beautiful nine of pentacles energy being very self-sufficient very independent they put you here on a pedestal the thing is that the universe is guiding them that um, they need to change uh, their mindset here with the world they need to end the cycle of thinking essentially and assuming that you would uh, you would reject them this is someone who has so much love to give they do want to come forward here scorpio but they are afraid they are afraid however i'm seeing that certain circumstances will play out to this person's advantage and they will at the end overcome their fears and they will show up here they will i feel that with the six of pentacles it might be a case that this person will start talking if you share uh, some sort of workplace or the, if it's someone from your work related environment they will start talking about work and this 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 kind of um conversation will flow but um, i'm seeing them taking action with the six of pentacles they do want to give you attention they want to come across as someone who's very very fair and who is who has good intentions in general and with the star this is a beautiful omen so I see them indeed overcoming at the end they fears. They will come forward either way because we have this, this page of pentacles. Mm -hmm. It's like this person wants to just, you know, your attention just a little bit. And I feel that they will gain it. There will be some sort of communication, conversation. Um, it doesn't have to be per se that this person will um, I, it might be that there will be many people you know surrounding you <laughs> exactly free of free of pentacles that will be many people it might be a work related uh, event or uh, it will be some sort of situation or um, I don't know maybe even party gathering something like this that there will be that it won't be both of you just you know uh, talking right or having a conversation it will be you'll be surrounded by other people that's why it may it might put this person at ease to kind of ah oh, okay you know i can just you know casually start talking to scorpio but they will take an action and i feel it will be something to do with uh with the circumstances will be quite favorable here for this person i feel that they will compliment you they will say that they respect you know how professional you are if it's someone from your workplace that they care a lot about you know um how you are with people and they really sees you as someone who is uh, very reliable and uh, it kind of shows this sort of kind of admiration here 
So you have someone, indeed Scorpio, who uh, who is all about the stability. They want to create a stable relationship, but th th at the moment they might be quite scared to come forward, and quite shy. But they will, they will, they will. And I feel it will kind of initiate some sort of change. Therefore, it might be a case that within time, you know, you become quite closer to each other and uh, this person will gain day by day more courage to kind of at the end express their feelings and intentions that they want to create, uh, they want to be in a relationship with you. Scorpio, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly appreciate you. Scorpio, have a fantastic and wonderful day. And once again, thank you very, very much for being with me. Take care. Bye.